Okay, I've got the, both the 24th and the 25th loaded up here. And what you're going to see is you're going to see star action here in this area. And then it's going to fling itself all the way around past the horizon of Earth over here and go down wherever it's shining at from way up here. Now, Pataglius and all this stuff is what you would think would be the bright stuff because that's the biggest stuff we know of cataloged a lot, okay? Because I'm going to back up in this area right here and also we'll see, and basically I'll just go back and hit the start and you'll see everything going on. Oh, hang on, i got to bring it back. And then we got Taurus and we have this here action up above Min Cab and Min Car. Check it out what comes in. And this is happening on the 24th and also on the evening of the 25th. I'm showing you the 24th, which I've already put in my video earlier. Now, Jupiter's the biggest, brightest thing. And as you've seen before, we get this crown action down there. But now, watch this here. You're going to see some light. See that? Now, check that out. And then watch it flings itself around over here. Let me bring that back for you so you can see it. And actually, I'll go to full here in a second. But we see that crowning go away from whatever star and action that's happened, which it looks like it illuminates Uranus for, and then we're going to get this, that's their star action there, and then it's going to win, take off. And if you watch the clocks over here, you're not going to be able to say it's an airplane or a satellite or anything, because it's not. It's too damn fast. And you watch the starlight, and then you can go back and you can stop and play, and play around with the video on the player, and then whammo, it's gone. It's starlight, because this is at nighttime, folks. This is 20 hundred hours in the evening, okay? Jupiter and everything's coming up. And let's back it up just enough so you can see what's going on here. You see this? And then watch this huge illumination of something there. Okay? And then you get all this here from nighttime from a star. Okay? And then check out what the star does down here. Check this action out where I got my cursor at. And I'll keep my cursor away. See that? Now watch it take off across. There it goes across the ocean over there. Way up over there. So I'm going to put it on full screen. And I'll take the magnifying glass with us. I believe I can take it with us. We'll get the magnifier up. I'll hit this. And we got the magnifier with us. And we can go over here and blow this up a little bit. And since we're on full screen, I can take you back here. And you'll be able to see this. Great. Because this is in the evening. Watch your clock. It's in the nighttime. And check this out. This star action. Okay. Now the moon comes up around 20 something. Okay. And you watch the video before this one, and you'll be able to see that. Okay, I'm going to show you all this action here, but then I see this starlight, so I want to get over here to where it is. And it just starts in about right here. Okay, you're going to watch it pop right here. Now this, the cursor is going to end up kind of hiding this, but you're going to see it take off across the horizon over there. Now watch over here. You see that take off over over there, like that. Now I'll watch again, and I'll I'll hit play. See that this bar won't. It used to be. It used to be that you move your cursor away. And this bar would disappear. Okay, so watch this sunlight, this starlight, which is sun, a uh, sun out there somewhere. Check that out, right there where my cursor was at. And now it goes, and then it goes flipping up over there. So I just shorten it up a little bit. You'll see this here come up here. I'll keep my cursor down. And you'll see that come up there, and actually there, there right away. You'll see that starlight in that area. Now there, see that? You can't miss it. And then up and over the horizon. It's not no damn plane. And watch the clocks. And you'll be able to play this and freeze it and watch these clocks over here. And you'll see that the actual factual that that is starlight. And it's in the 20 hot, it's in the evening time, it's in the dark. And there's all this light from up and, and there you get that little star. Now watch it go over across the ocean. Boom. Just like that. We'll do that one more time real fast. Watch it's going to come up here and move my cursor out of the way. And then it'll fling out across the ocean to the left lower. There you go. So. You shouldn't be able to miss that. It's all over here in this area. It's going to come up here and it's going to fling out over this way. There it came up and there it flings away. And I'll back it up just a little bit more. I know it's really repetitive, but it's there. And we'll see what kind of we can get on it. And there it goes over the horizon. And we'll, we'll, we'll basically go to about right here. And you're going to see the same thing on the 25th hole be able to put that in real fast. So let's go ahead and if we can magnify up here. And I'd watch it take off all over top. See? So now I can back that up and it basically should
And actually, I don't think it went back far enough. You know, we'll put it right like this. It'll go away, and you'll end up seeing all that action. And it's a star that's doing that. Star in the nighttime. This is a nighttime shot, and that, all that happened there at night. And I'll just pop it back again since we had it higher, and we can actually we'll go up one more resolution. And I think it's coming up in us right now, but basically we'll back it up. We got the right resolution. Now we'll just go away and watch it corner. The full size. I think I can get us down. And here the video starts out. Get back down and out of the way. We've got to blow it up. We should be able to see all this star action over here in the left hand corner. Pretty wild, huh? And here it comes and there it went. That was all that star action right there. And you can see it still kind of dances around over here too is when I got it blown up. You see all that dancing around that it does? That's starlight. So, another volcano that's going to get uh, awakened here sooner or later. So, what's making this basically the whole sky go black is what we're wanting to know. We're getting blinking in space. Now watch all these remnants also in this asteroid belt or whatever that we've got around us. And I've showed you the asteroid belt before. Okay, that's around the sun and all of us. Well, check this out, what's going on. Because we've got the remnants and everything in the sky. And we also get the blink. Let me show you that blink. See that blink that's going on? And you've seen it when I started it. Hey, check out how massively dark and closer that these all these remnants seem to be. Those are not weather spots on the camera, folks. Okay? Those are remnants that go away when it gets dark. But check them out before. Look how big in that. Remember that blink that you get? Look how huge that they've gotten. Those spots out there in space, in daylight. And then as it gets dark, they go away. When we get a lot of light, we can see them up in the sky. There's lots of objects out there between us and the sun and so forth. As you can see, as they all disappear there as it gets dark. Watch the clock down on the lower right. Okay? And then let's try to see what we can see in the lower left on the 23rd here, because I backed up. This is the first time I've looked at the 23rd. Let's look for the light, the starlight in the lower left. Now there's Jupiter as it comes up. And you check that out. You see that? Now I saw it. Now I'm going to back it up and see if we can freeze that. What I'm seeing. Watch around here. There's something to be flashing. See that flashing around? so damn fast that's not in the planes, I can tell you that right now. Watch this flashing, you're going to see flashing around. It's going to be flashing around in the clouds. You see it flashing around in the clouds? Let's see if I can freeze it this time. And there you go. You see this here? Watch this here flashing around. Maybe you'll get another flash, but if you back it up a little bit, matter of fact, I can do it here. And I'm going to catch that flash. Here comes Jupiter up. There it was. Let me see if I can get it back here. Just a little bit more, and then freeze it. And there is it flashes. I barely got him there. Tape here, but 
at least I was able to show you it. And there's that flash, and there it is, very left. I'll put my pointer on it there. And I see if I can freeze it one more time. It looks like it's gone away. But you definitely get to see it there. Let's see if I get lucky and freeze it. And there it was. Again, as you can see it pop up on the screen. So there's definitely a star. And as you can see the halo at the same time. You see this halo effect? This is nighttime. 1854. Let's see if I can freeze it again. I haven't run out of tape yet. Here comes Jupiter up. There it is dancing around on these clouds down here. You can see it dancing. Is that there a little earlier too? You can see it in the clouds. And there it is. That's the best I can see of it right there. And the first conjunction we get of it, it's somewhere, it's something to do with Alder Baron possibly and Jupiter possibly. Because there it is right there. And basically, I'll just take the magnifier and blow up on it. And then we'll play it a little bit more. Now, there's also possibly something there, too. But there it is. And it's definitely there. And it's definitely a burst of light. Okay? Whether it comes off of Aldebaran and Jupiter, or if it's from our whatever we figure that's way up in the sky, by Mencab and Mencar. But that's pretty much beginning to look like it's up from Mencar, Mencar because of the angle would not be off of Jupiter and Aldebaran. So there is something definitely in the sky. Okay? You can't miss it there. As a matter of fact, we can just pump up on that some more. It's not no airplane. I guarantee it's not no airplane. Okay? So we've definitely got something interesting in our space in sky. And then now let me see if I can get it ahead to freeze it in the other spots. Hang on. We'll just leave the magnifier there. And I freeze, hopefully I can freeze and get what we have already seen in the video. We're going to take a look at that right there. And if I can bring up the screen here, go a little higher too. And you, as you see, we're getting what we're getting at Min Cab and Min Car right up there too. But I'm going to blow in on this because basically it's right there. So it's coming up from up here. We have a huge star up there somewhere. Something's weird is going on. Okay, let me save some tape. Now here we are, we're blown up on it, and there it is, okay? And it's, if you see here, it's also got, so it's terahydrons, it's actually a triangulation, okay? It's coming from some star way the hell up. Okay, there's where Orion's supposed to be. Now I'll line us down, and basically we'll hit play. Okay, remember this halo effect that we're getting off whatever this star is. And remember, this is dark, this is nighttime, okay? And... We're going to zoom in on it because we got that object right there, okay? It's the same starlight. It's one of those triangulations, and I can move over to it. I'll get a little look at it. There you go. I'll get in a little bit more on it. And it ain't no UFO, folks. You're never going to hear Bino say it's a UFO. It's some kind of starlight that we're getting from a sun, a star out there in space. And as you can see, it moves around a lot, and it's got triangulation to it. It moves real fast, and you can see pretty much there's a node, and there's a node, and there's a node. And I'll blow it up a little bit more so you realize what we're looking at. And I can even come down in a minute. And run by Orion, and there it is, it's over there. So there we go. And then I'll get out of it, zoom out, and you can see what we're looking at is right there on the screen. So zoom in on it. Some kind of weird action. You can't miss it, it's right there. And we'll zoom out. Boom, 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 boom. And then we'll also go ahead and hit play because we've seen what we've already seen from the, uh, the night. And we'll scroll up, and then basically you'll see more than likely some a little bit of Uranus right there. You'll see it. No matter what, you can see the huge halo of something, the outline of something there. And I'll hit play real fast here. And there it goes away. So watch the video before this on the 24th, and you can see this right here in a better shot on the 24th. But we see good on the 23rd. It's right there. 